It's a piece of art honoring some of Vigo County's most influential people. Dr. Greg Bell is painted with the likes of Larry Bird and Tony, Tony Holman at the Vigo County Courthouse. Today was the first time Bell saw the nearly completed piece. Zeke Torres joins us with his reaction. Zeke. Mike, that's right. A doctor, a two-time national champion, and almost a world record holder on several occasions. The list of accomplishments goes on and on for Greg Bell. Now, from politicians to athletes, this mural serves as a tool highlighting some of the area's most decorated history. A mural with 53 faces and a story that dates back centuries. Dr. Greg Bell says he was surprised to see his face on it. I'm flattered to be among a lot of great people. Uh, this is not how I see myself. I never looked at myself as anything other than Greg Bell. And I did what I could do best to the best of my ability. Artist Bill Wolf says he hopes this mural will be a community cornerstone. The whole purpose of painting these murals was to hopefully inspire kids that come, happen to come through and see the people that have, are of note in, in from Vigo County. Bell began his career as an aspiring pole vaulter for Garfield High School, but a back injury turned his focus to broad jump. In 1948, he lost in the state finals. Seven years later, Bell exacted revenge against the same opponent he was defeated by, Russ Smith. He calls that moment pivotal. Russ Smith beat me four inches in 1948. In 1955, I beat Mr. Russ Smith four feet. And I must admit, I gloated. Then a couple of years later, Bell won the gold medal for the long jump at the 1956 Melbourne Olympic Games. Bell, who is also a veteran, would enroll at Indiana University and join the track team. He finished his career as a two-time national champion with an undefeated record. I hope that they'll try to find out something about me or whichever one they happen to look at. Find out what kind of groundwork I had to lay. I wasn't aspiring to be anything except the best Greg Bell I could be. Now, Wolf tells me he plans to add the name of every person to the mural. And actually, Mike, I got to hold that medal, and let me tell you, man, it's pretty heavy. I bet so. What a guy, uh, Dr. Bell. Congratulations. All right, thank you, Zeke, for that report. Some local